Howdy folks, this is Checkers, and this is Pickpocketing with Miller Peshak. We are going to learn to pickpocket from the Miller here. First thing we need to do is talk to him, and as part of our debt to him, we're going to have to pay him back, so... I've got the money to pay that debt. And I was afraid you had a chamber pot for a head. Hand it over. That job's still going, if you're interested. And of sure, course... I'm on it. He will mention the other job we're doing, but at the bottom here, will you teach me to pickpocket? Would you teach me something about the, uh, milling craft? Like how to get things out of strangers' purses into your own? Aye, why not? You're handy enough. No doubt you'll master it. Come behind the mill where we won't be seen. Okay, and interesting side note, when I did this in the Let's Play series, the Lord of the Keep came down and, well, sort of caught me in the act. But he mostly ignored it. It was just... We're talking Lord Hanush, the big lord of the whole town. Kind of surprising. Anyway, let's follow Peshek back here right quick. And we'll go over the basics because it's a little different than I expected. Here we go. I'll stand here and pretend I don't know you're there. You try sneaking up behind me without me seeing you, and take something from my purse. First, you have to rummage in the purse. The longer you do it, the better chance you have of finding something valuable, but also of getting caught in the act. Once you've found something you want, you've got to pull it out, carefully, but fast enough so I don't notice. Try stealing my dagger. It's there, mixed up with other things. Okay, so we want to get into stealth, get behind Miller Peshek here, and now you'll notice that we can pickpocket by holding down E. So we'll hold that down, and a clock is counting up. I think we want to be in the green here before we get to red, and then we want to try to maneuver down here, take this, oh, and I didn't make Caught it. You. If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Try it again. So let's go over that again. Hold down the use key. A counter will start to count. Caught you. If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Try it it's, again. It's not really quite as easy as you might think. So we're going to give it another whirl here. Let that counter go up. I think we want to be in a nice green color. Caught you. If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Try yeah, it yeah. Again. Okay, Miller Peshek. Let's roll. All right. We're getting green, getting green. We need enough time to get the thing and then get out of his pocket. Okay, so there. We left and right to get to the item, hit use, and then left and right back to That's exit. The way. I hardly noticed you were there. Hit use again. I think you're ready to try it out for real. Best practice on drunks and sleeping folk, so you don't end up in jail before you even get started. Thanks, Pashek. You're welcome. But I'll be having that dagger back now. Okay, so... If he's going to let us practice again, no, he's not. But the key there is you hold down the use key and you're basically loading up a counter for how much time you have to look around in his pockets. So the more time you give yourself, the more chance you'll find something valuable. However, the more risk you're taking. When you let go of the timer, then you can maneuver around inside his pocket using the strafe left, strafe right keys. And when you strafe over to the item you want, hit enter, it'll reveal it, and then left, right, out of the pocket. And, well, you've pickpocketed. It takes a little bit of practice, so don't be bashful about coming to visit Miller Peshek and learning more about the Miller's trade. For the moment, though, this has been Checkers with a look at pickpocketing with Miller Peshek in Kingdom Come Deliverance. I would like to thank you for watching. I hope you found the video informative and maybe just a little entertaining. I would like to invite you to subscribe, like, and share if you so desire, and to ask you, above all, to please take care.